Hello, welcome to this edition of Roland Sports. I'm Tyler Roland. We're coming to you from Lewis County High School. And with me is, of course, one of the, one of the, I should say, one of the key players on the softball team over the last few seasons, a softball team that has had a lot of success getting from the region to the regional finals this year. And then the prior two years, state tournament appearances, including a final four. And with me is Emily Cole. And Emily, it's good to, Good to see you here. Let's start first off um, talking about your softball career and uh, similar to what I asked Sarah Page, let's um, with Lewis County, uh, what is it that you like about the community and, and what what is it about the community that sets it apart and how special it is? Um, it's definitely really special. I mean, when you come to your home field and you see hundreds of fans there cheering you on, it's just really special. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and, and getting you to go to Marshall this fall and I mean, getting to play at a, a, a very high level in Marshall, gosh, I'm going to have a heck of a good softball stadium, just haven't been there quite a few times. So talk about what, what led to that decision and what you like about Marshall. Yeah, I'm super excited to be going to Marshall. I mean, the coaching staff is wonderful. The players, they get along really good. It's really good team chemistry. I'm really interested in their health programs. They have really good health school. They're really good. So. Mm -hmm. And what do you plan on, on major? Uh, I've been back and forth. I thought about maybe pharmacy, but now I'm kind of leaving for physical therapy. So I'm going to shout out a few places and see which one I want to do. That's awesome. And in softball, I know, um, I know it's, um, that's your main focus as a sport. And it's the one sport that you, you've put a lot into. Talk about how, um, how your regimen is over the off season. Like you see typically you'll, play in the spring and then what goes on the, the rest of the year for you with training? Um, normally during the off season, my team and I, we gather in the high school gym with the batting cage or sometimes when it's nice to go on the field and we really work on hitting, building, pitching, pitching, just the basics and we try to get better just to better ourselves for the season. And what do you feel in your career that it's been that um, uh, quality or something that you that you had or did on the side that helped set you apart as a player? Well, me and my dad worked really hard every night, every day, at my house pitching and pitching, so I really thank him for that. My goal for every game is to come off the field mentally and physically exhausted, uh, no regrets, and I feel like that was a good thing I did this year. And, and what, um, what, what will you, uh, um, when it comes to this off season um, or this summer, what are you going to, or are you going to work out at Marshall with the team? Or what will be the, um, what, what will be your experience? Um, right now, I'm just working on perfecting my pitches right now, and I'm beginning into running right now during the off season. And I play travel, travel softball, so I'll be with my team every weekend, traveling different places and playing. I'll come out here travel softball team a little bit. Um, um, like where, where you guys go and um, just tell me about it and what led you to getting involved. Um, my pitching coach, his name's Scoob Bella, he um, introduced me to this team and I've been on this team since freshman year and I'm actually going to play at Marshall with a teammate of mine. She's my third baseman, so we're mm -hmm. going to room together. I really like her. She's super sweet. Um, I play in a lot of different states with this team. They're really good. They're awesome. I think we have one of the best teams in this area as a child softball team. We get along, and we're just pretty good. Um, how have you felt that, that playing travel ball has benefited you? Maybe if somebody were watching this and was considering, um, why do you think uh, a softball player that would be, would be good for them? Um, travel softball has introduced me to so many things. It's given me a lot of opportunities that I'm very thankful for. Um, getting to play on the biggest stages in front of all the coaches I've seen. So many coaches come out and watch our game. That's just amazing. Um, you get to play the best teams in the country, and it just helps you better yourself as a person and get ready for college. Mm -hmm. And we'll talk. Let's let's shift the topic a little bit to academics. Uh, uh, what what do you uh, what is your favorite school set? I really like anatomy classes and health classes right now. Mm -hmm. And um, and when it comes to um, what are involvements on the side, what is it? Are you in maybe a club at school, or do you have something on the, maybe a cool accomplishment on the academic end? Um, I'm in Beta Club and host a club at my high school. Mm -hmm. Yeah, tell me about Beta Club. Um, with Beta Club, you have to 
um, volunteer, and it's really good where you can get out in your community and help people. I like uh, taking pictures for the yearbook and going to all the sporting events, so that's what I did this year for. It. Oh, wow. So, so you went to, for, and did photography at a lot of the games? Yeah, me and my friend did. It was a super fun experience just seeing the other sports and the team chemistry on the different sports. I mean, it's so much different from basketball to softball to football, and I think it's really cool to see. Well, I know you had, um, of course, Sarah Page and several others, and I know you all were, were pretty close. Talk about that friendship and just what it was, uh, uh, what it was like getting to, getting to have, have such a unique opportunity. I've been with a lot of these girls since Little League, so it's awesome to grow together, and they're my best friends. And I've had Sarah through my side um, since Little League, and she's one of my best friends. So I, I really appreciate the bond, and I feel like we'll have that for a lifetime, and I'm really blessed to play with her. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and and then um, and then what would be a cool fact about herself? Maybe something that that not a lot of people know. Um, my first varsity pitching start was against Montana Fouts. And I'll never forget that. I was in seventh grade. <laughs> oh, wow. yeah. That is that is awesome. You see her now, and she's starting out. That's pretty pretty cool fact. Lastly, are there any shout outs you'd like to give? Um, to my family and friends. We thank you for watching this episode of Rolling Sports, where you meet the athletes. Be sure and stay tuned and check out Sarah Page Weddington's interview as well, one of Emily's teammates for softball and. We thank you all for watching this episode of Rolling Sports, where you meet the athletes.